morning, my name is Jim Marshall-Andrew. I'm the Sales Director at Nomis Connections. What I want to do today is talk to you about the porting of numbers from ISDN to SIP trunks. It's something I'm regularly asked during meetings. There's talk of BT obviously disbanding ISDN in 2025. There are also numerous commercial benefits and functional benefits of moving to SIP trunks. What I want to do is just give you a high level overview of the steps you need to go through to reassure you that when Nomus Connections do a port of this nature, we're a safe pair of hands and we know what we're doing. So, first thing to do is check your main number, your main telephone number, and ensure your SIP provider has a porting agreement in place which will allow the transfer. Second thing you should do is send your BT bills to Nomus Connections. We can then run some analysis and checks. Typically we come back and say that you can save up to 50% by moving to SIP. In addition you will gain all the increased functionality. You then need to check your current on-site telephone system or PBX is actually SIP compatible. You can either ask your maintainer or contact Nomus Connections and we will let you know. You then need to make sure you have suitable bandwidth available so you can route your voice calls over your data connection. You need to allow for around about 100k per voice call. Again, at Nomus we'll happily recommend suitable bandwidth to ensure you get the quality of service you're used to over ISDN. You then need to serve notice on your current ISDN provider. At this stage I suggest you check contract termination details to make sure you're covered. We will then complete a letter of authority and let you add some of the additional detail to that letter that effectively allows us to inform the losing provider and winning provider that this port is going to take place. It's really important we get the detail correct on there to ensure, in, ensure a smooth port. Porting typically takes around 21 days, so once you factor that in, what we'll do is we will agree a port date. Nomus will then place the order with the SIP provider, which in our case is Gamma. They have a tier one network around the UK and they're the UK's fastest growing SIP provider. So a fantastic choice. We're also one of their first platinum partners. The new SIP provider then advises the losing provider that the numbers will be moving across. We're then able to confirm a port date. Once we have that in the background, we will set up a SIP account. The system will then be tested with a series of dummy numbers in the background so we can do some test calls and ensure everything is working. During all of this process, there's no impact to your business. Everything is running business as usual. We're just doing it all in the background. So once the system is tested and everything's going, on the day of the porting, you're then given either an AM or PM time slot. When the port is actually physically switched to move from ISDN to SIP, there's up to 30 minute downtime, so no calls will come through. If that's going to have a massive impact on your business, talk to me and we can let you know what the options are for out of hours porting or potentially weekend porting. Once that's happened, the port is complete, all is working and your SIP trunking is now in place and you're ready to go. Hopefully that's given you a good high level overview of the port process. Ultimately we will manage it as your telecoms expert and make sure the transition is smooth and keep you informed all the way along. If you want any further detail or especially if you want to talk about moving from ISDN to SIP please email me my details JMA at nomisconnections.co.uk. Many thanks for listening. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.